What's up, guys? Mr. Drew Puppet here with your Indie Wednesday. This week we're doing Rex. Blah, 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 blah. Oops, I deleted your save file. Oh, that's rude. Anywho, we're playing Retro Pixel Castles. Yes, it's a very interesting game. You're about building castles and it's in pixel form. It's actually kind of cool. Very resource gathery. This is an in dev version, but you can get it on the Steam store for. $15, but you can also go to the Kickstarter and back it for $7, and you get a free copy of the game to activate on Steam on the 27th. Yes, so this game has a map editor as well as, obviously, enough playing the game. And uh, it's just a tech demo, obviously, enough. And there's seven current maps. I haven't really delved into that whole thing. You got the desert map, uh, uh, harvest tests, all sorts of fun crap. And we're just going to go with this map because it's the only one I know. So, let's go right in. And you start off with, where are my people? There they are. They're my wonderful people. And that is a lake, I believe. And there we go. I can slide around now. And those are just destroyed everything. Oh, that's cute as hell. All right, so we're going to set our village on fire by putting it right here. And you can go in here and... Obviously enough, do all this, make them all work. Now, they don't do normal AI st or game-related stuff. They do their own shit because it's all AI-oriented, so they do their own thing. You can't tell them what to do except for, well, building the village center. Then you can really just put down what you need, and then they'll go do it, so to speak. Now we have crystals around the map, we have food around the map, I'm pretty sure that's crystals, 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 food, there's various food around the map that I can go harvest, little sh there's little shacks around that I can fix on up, and there's a, what is that, a lumber shack, that's a lumber shack I can go work on, there's lumber shacks everywhere, I don't know if I can actually really repair them, but um, yeah, they're there nonetheless. And I can, I can go work on them, and I, I don't know. I, I guess I can work on them. I'm not entirely sure, to be perfectly honest. And now we're just going to let them do the little thing. I can't really zoom in, but we're just going to go... Not that. We're going to go to the mini-map, and there we are. And I can't really zoom in at all, but we're right there. There's various buildings. You can see lava, water, sand, stone, all sorts of yada, yada, yada jazz. What the hell? What the... No, no, what the? I can't back yet. Get back to the main menu. Oh, there we go. Aha! Victory! I win. Oh, that's why I was off the map. Okay. Where the hell am I? Down here? Down here. I need more stone. I should... That's the one thing. If they're all assigned to this crap, I can just do that. And then they'll go to the stone, which is very nice. Oh, thank you. Stone is very loud. Now, I'm not entirely sure how to raise population, because I haven't really figured it out yet, but eventually I'll be able to figure it out. Not, obviously, in this playthrough, or this little showcase, but, uh, yeah. Anywho, if I haven't mentioned at all, I'm not entirely sure if I have. You can, the Kickstarter is going until the 27th, that's when the day, that's when the game comes out on Steam, but you can still go back it, give them more money if you want to, I don't know, give them more money. It's cheaper on Kickstarter, so if you want to go grab it, then go grab it. There will be a link in the description for that, as long as one, as well as one in the, or for the Steam Store version. Oh, there's the music, I was waiting for that to pop in. Now, while the villagers are mining all this crap, there are other villagers actually building the village center. As you can see, you can just watch this go down. And once this is done, tiles opens, and we get to get more stuff like lumber mills and farms and all sorts of fun crap. And they just need one. There we go. And there we go. Farming. I'm just going to build a... I want to build a... I want to build a regular sized farm right there. Actually, come here, you. And I want to go back, and I want resource storage and food storage. Right here. And we're gonna go get... We can build walls as well. And there's a debug menu. I haven't really looked inside of that yet. I'm not really gonna worry about that too much, to be perfectly honest. Not until later, at least. Alright, we're gonna build a lumber mill. Where do we want to put down a lumber mill? Let's drop one right here. 
here. I can't put one right there, son of a bitch. All right, let's go. I need to clear that out first. I'm not doing that yet. Stone Shack. Stone Shack can go right here. Here, here. There we go. Wow, that farm is getting so much wood right now. Holy crap, man. All right, let's get let's get more more lumber down, I guess. All right, once that farm's built, uh, they'll probably start... Oh, who the hell needs wood? Oh, you need stone. Okay. So we got people building stone, or delivering stone. We got people delivering wood, which is nice. Uh, they're going to finish building, or uh, bringing the stone, and once every, or we're out of resources as a whole, they're just going to start bringing everything else out and all sorts of fun crap will ensue. Oh, they need one more wood. That's a noxious as hell. There we go. Now people are starting to work on it. All right, so we have the stone shack. And we're going to work on the stone shack. I don't know. There's not... There's a lot of waiting around, honestly. So I guess we can go into housing. So housing is a thing. We go in here, and obviously enough, we do housing. Housing, housing, housing. And what else is there? Resource gathering, lighting. You can build small wood torches. Boom, 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 boom. People are doing that. Oh, people are mining again. Okay. There's need for more. Oh, there is need for more stone. Okay. There's need for more wood, too. That's a thing, though. Oh, okay. These things actually need stone. All right, I'm going to go jump into the spew blood toggle grid. Oh, God, what the hell? That's awesome. Oh, I can't really do anything with that. Oh, I can add entities, though. Oh, God, I added way too many. Holy shit. I have 59 population now. Oh, God, I've made a terrible mistake. The debug mode. That's awesome, but I am slowly just not going to have enough. Oh god, no, 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 I just added way more, I have 64 people now, holy crap, everyone's slowly dying, oh Jesus, that is a problem in half, right, right, can we have you people actually work on, oh my god, really, there we go, there we freaking go, can I get people to work on lumber mills now, is it a thing, possibly, no, no one's gonna work on lumber yet, no, no, no one's going to work on lumber. Let's, you know, attempt to try this. Come on. Like I said, it is the in-dev mode, or this is in-dev, so it's not really a functioning alpha yet. But it does look promising. It's a pretty fun game. Anywho, this game is on the Steam Store and in Kickstarter. Both links in the description. Anywho, my name is Mr. Dude Puppet. Uh, subscribe today to become a Camp Freedom Light, and I will see you guys on the next episode. Goodbye for now.